What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of DBD Builds. Today we are playing as the fabulous Ada Wong and we are using the Spec Ops build, aka the Special Ops build featured in my top three sneaky builds video. If you haven't already seen it, check it out. Three sneaky builds, three fun, amazing builds to be a more stealthy player, but also just survive and get to the end game and win because that's ultimately the goal. Let's talk about the build. Iron Will, Boon Shadow Step, Detective's Hunch, Kindred. We're going to discuss these perks individually, but the idea of this build is to be that enigma, that kind of stealthy player, that difficult to track player, but also have a lot of intel and know what's going on in the game so you know where you're needed, you know what you need to be doing, you know how to progress the game. Um, kind of what the theme of this build is. So we're starting off with Iron Will. This muffles our Grunts of Pains by 75%. It doesn't work when we're exhausted, but we're not using any perks that will cause us to be exhausted, so not an issue for this build. This is just going to help us be a lot more stealthier in those moments where we are actually injured. So this way we're harder to track, we're harder to hear, we can be a little bit sneaky. Good stuff. Boon Shadow Step. Kind of the center stone of this build, whenever we boon a totem, whenever we find a totem, we can bless it to make this boon active. All survivors within the boon's range will have their scratch marks hidden and their auras hidden from the killer. And it lingers for four seconds after we leave the boon's 24 meter range. So this makes it very safe. Whenever you're around the boon, if you're trying to loot the killer, they're not gonna see your scratch marks. If the killer has a perk to reveal your aura, they're not gonna see your aura. So working in the boon or around the boon is just going to be very safe. So the idea is we want to boon a totem next to the gen we're working on. So that way we work on that gen and we know we're good and not being revealed. And if for some reason we were injured, remember our grunts of pains are muffled. So if we're in chase around the boon, we're going to be slippery and hard to track because the killer will not have the audio cues and they also won't have the aura revealing cues or the scratch marks. So these are our stealth perks for the build. Third perk is Detective's Hunch. Every time we finish a gen, we will see all chests, all totems, and all generators within 64 meters of us. If we have a map, these everything that gets revealed will be added to the map. Not really applicable for us because we're not running a map, but we could if we wanted to. So the thing with this is whenever a gen gets done, we will be able to see all the gens, all the totems within 24 meters of us. So what we want to be looking for is where is the totems? Where are the gens? So that way we can move to the next totem slash gen. So we relocate, boom the totem, work on the gen, finish the gen, see it all, and then you kind of get the vibe here. See where the next totems are at, see where the next gens are at. Find a totem close enough to the gen, bless the totem, go back to working on the gen safely and discreetly. Because that's this build, the Spec Ops build, guys. And then the last perk we're running is Kindred. And this is just going to be round everything out together because we got a lot of stealthy perks, but Kindred, whenever a survivor is on the hook, the killer's aura within 16 meters of the hook will be revealed to us and all other survivors. And also when we're the one on the hook, all survivors will see each other's auras and still see the killer's aura as well. So this is gonna just help you coordinate a lot better. So like I said, we're gonna be booting and just trying to work on gens and just kind of staying away from the killer. But there's going to be times where we actually might need to be the ones to go in for the rescue. Um, and we'll know that intel because of Kindred. So it just rounds it out. We've got a little killer aura reveal. We've got some survivor aura reveals. We can see the gems. We can see the totems. This build is just all about intel and just knowing what's going on. So that way you know what to do. Let's hop into some games. All right, guys. We're on the Wreckers yard. <laughs> Auto Wreckers. Auto Haven Wreckers. Wreckers Haven. Auto 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 <laughs> all right so i actually don't really know where the boon is here i don't see a boon but when we do a gen we will we will see where the boons are at and it's a blight i hear him but i don't see him all right he's chasing the other girl actually we'll just do a quick little run around like we, the thing with this build though is like if we don't know where the boons are at. Oh, snaps! Holy cow! Where did he come from? Alright, alright. This build is not meant for this. 
<laughs> We're not supposed to be taking chase. We're supposed to be stealthy and discreet. My god. Yeah, he came, He literally came out of nowhere. Let me actually reposition next to the locker. So if he tries to pick me up, maybe he'll open the locker. It's always funny when that happens. Um, but what I was saying is, if you don't exactly know where the totem is from the start, just do the first gen, so that way you get your detective's hunch, so you can see the totems. Because um, sometimes you can waste a lot of time trying to find a totem, especially if you don't have all the spawns memorized. And, you know, I've been playing this game for, like, I don't know, what, five, six months now, and I still don't have all the totem spawns memorized. Alright, but I have 99. No, 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 don't pick me up. Don't pick me up. Oh, come on, get me up, girl. Oh. Oh, I screamed. Oh, snappers. Okay, she took a dead heart hit. Very nice. Dudes. Dudes. We need to actually just work on these gens a little bit. I'm going to use my health pack real quick. I'm just going to heal up. I've got a green health pack. So I heal up really quick. 50% quicker. Because um, we're, we're getting... This dude is just going ham on us, man. We got to work on these gens. He hasn't hooked anybody, though, so it's not as bad as it seems. But it could potentially be very bad if we all get slugged. Um, I'm not going to go pick that Curly up yet. I'm going to finish this jet. Oh, okay. Now we might have to start picking people up. Alright, crap. Uh, please don't walk this way. I hope you're 99. Please be 99. All right, good, 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 good. All right, good. Oh god. All right, all right, all right. Decent kindred value. Ooh. What? No way. He knows I'm here. How? What? How does he know, bro? Oh, I've messed that up. Damn it. All right, they got her out of the hook. Let me go over here to this pallet. Oh, I wonder. Did he did maybe he just barely saw me, or maybe he had barbecue. Oh god! All right, there's a boon. We need to get that shadow step up. I don't know how he saw my aura. Oh, detective's hunch went off also, and I literally wasn't even looking. Oh my god, this is a sloppy game, dudes. This 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 blight literally just hit the ground running. He doesn't like hooking, though. He just wants to slug everybody. God. Literally, I would, if I was running Boon Exponential, I'd be getting some mad value. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me, bro? Oh, no. What is happening? Oh, my God. Dude, this guy is just leaving my pretty slugged. Base kit unbreakable. I'm ready for you. Where's the new where's the new patch changes? Oh my god, dude. The one time I don't run, we're gonna live forever. Oh god. What are you doing, girl? What are you doing, girl? Okay. What a what a weird game, man. What a weird ass game. Get me up. Let's get out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. Did we finish this gen? Oh my god. We're close to finishing it. Is it worth healing? Bro, let's just get these gens done. He's not hooking. I think we should just finish this gen first. Oh my god. He wants to slug everybody? Oh, he's going to see exactly where we're at, too. Toad him there. Toad him there. What the heck, dude? Oh my god. Let's just bless this. Let's get her. Let's get her shadow step up. And then we'll heal up. Oh, please don't. Oh my god, dude. I don't know how this guy's finding me every freaking time. Alright, let's heal up. Let's heal up. Oh, Nancy. Don't get slugged, please. Alright, 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 alright. Let's go get this guy up. I hear him. Alright, he's, he's chasing Nancy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Oh, shit. 
This build doesn't cover screaming! Oh my god, dudes. Okay. Something for me to loot. We've got our shadow step. Ah, oh, dude. This dude is cracked. Holy shit. Alright, now he's actually hooking. Oh my god, dude. Alright, three hooks in, two gens done. This is a crazy game. But all things considered, like, it's it's not the worst. Like, we, we do keep getting slugged, but at least we got two players who've healed up. Um, but two gens done and three hooks in is really not bad. And I think he's changing up his play style. He's actually hooking people now. Um, I think he was trying to get, just slug everybody, but he's, looks like he's given up on that and changed his playstyle a little bit. Um, let's get, uh, should we get her off the hook first, or heal me first? I'll get her off the hook, we'll, that way we'll double heal, we'll heal quicker. I don't want to. I don't want anything to do with that. Oh my god, dude! Bless the totem. Oh my goodness, dude! This game is cracked. Totem over there. Totem over there. Jen over there. Totem over there. So those are my totems. One, two, and then I'm blessing this one. I'm gonna work on this Jen. All right. So I have my shadow step up. So if we had barbecue, he should technically not see me. I do see him with Kindred though. He's running the other way. Uh, should I get the save? Damn it, I'm going for the save. Those other two are getting pressured. I don't, I don't like doing this because I'm injured. Oh no, this is bad. That's bad. Please, please don't be paying attention. Please don't be looking. Oh, snaps! No! Oh, that was horrible timing, man. They ran back to the shack right when I went in for the save. Oh god, dude, I should have just stayed on the gen. Whoa, dude, this this is one crazy ass game. Holy crap! All right, I'm gonna run back to my shadow stuff. Damn you, blight! Jesus Christ. Holy crap, dude. This dude needs to lay off the steroids. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god, we're both dead on hook. Let's finish this gen. At least if we get this gen done, there's a chance. There will be a chance. And I'll see where the last three gens are at as well once this perk pops. What a, what an insane game, dudes. Fantastic, we got a gen done, nice. All right, so totem there, gen there, totem there, no gens. Gen over there, totem there. So those are the last two gens. Wait, where's the third gen? Oh, it must be on the side of the map. Holy crap, don't come this way. Do not come this way, oh my god, dude. No, don't go for Meg. Damn, she's dead on hook. Alright. Still had the lingering shadow step. Alright, I see her working on that gen over there, or she's blessing the boon. Oh, boy. Bloody hell. Um. Well. Dude's freaking crap. I'm not even gonna boon, dude. I'm just gonna go straight for this gen. Really need to just get it done. Like, he, he moves so quick that I think every second matters in the situation, and I'm not exactly sure where the boon's at. It was like here somewhere. And there's one over there. Come on, let's get this gen done, dude. Let's get out of this game. This is a nightmare, dude. Like, this is one scary ass blight. Like, oh my god. Alright, he's chasing the other girl. Come on, Nancy. Spell some time, girl. 
Might be the end of DVD build story. We're we're running away. We're not even playing this game. Shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, we're gonna we'll boon. We're gonna boon. We're gonna put our shadow stuff up. Might come in clutch later, who knows? At least it's going to cover the shack, too, so if we're looping shack... Oh, hell yeah, baby! Holy shit. Holy shit, balls. The door. The door. Oh my god, dude. Oh, we're all broken, too. We can't even heal. He's using the Mastermind's perk. Okay, he's chasing Ada. He looks like he's committing down to Ada. Okay, we got a door open. I don't remember where that door was at. Oh, dude, Warden Slayer said, F this. He just freaking left. <laughs> uh, yeah, dude, I don't, I do not blame him. Also, absolutely random, but look at how quiet we are with Iron Will and Ada Wong. I think, like, she makes, like, almost no noise. I don't know if that's a glitch, but it's something I noticed. Like, Ada Wong makes literally, like, zero noise with Iron Will. I'm sorry. I, there's no way I can save her. Camping! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! I have to leave this game! The game is getting under my skin! Holy crap, dude, that blight was cracked! Oh my god, what a what a freaking wild game. Holy crap. Like, this build is, like, for more of a slow-paced game. I mean, it still performed, though. It still performed. But anyways, let's hop into another one. That was insane, dude. Enduring, Infectious Fright, The Yell and Reveal Their Location, Terminus, Everybody Stays Broken, Shadowborn, Increase FOV, Reveals All Survivors in 8 meters for 3 seconds after a slam. Oh, that's interesting. Alright guys, we're back on the Colwyn Farms. Let's... Do it! Alright, we're next to Jen. We're gonna go straight to work. I won't see any totems off the top of my head. There might be one on this tractor here. Uh, let me, I'm, I'm just gonna check real quick. I'm, I'm not gonna waste a bunch of time, but ah yes, let's do it. Let's put our shadow step up. Just to cover our asses, okay? Literally, to cover our asses. Just blessing me a little bit. Oh, it's a wraith. Alright, shadow step up. Her scratch marks are hidden. So it's going to be harder for the Wraith to track her. He still found her, though. I'm just going to hang out here for a little bit. Uh, he's kicking the gen. Oh, he's going to come for the boon. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll just, uh, we'll just give him a little the slippery nips. A little slippery nips. He's going to stuff my boon. We're not leaving any scratch marks. And now we're leaving scratch marks. But we have got away. We have already got away. Alright. There's another boon there. There's the gen. The boon. I do hear this guy. But I do not see this guy. Where is he? Oh, he's in the building. Alright, let's put our shadow step up. And we'll work on uh, one of these two gens that were close to us. Yeah, I'll work on main building gen, I think, after we put this boon up. And then we can save that one for later. Well, actually, it's regressing. I need to go touch it. From the safety of the boon, baby. Sneaky boon. Sneaky boonin. Yeah, we'll, we'll work on this one. Hopefully we don't get three gened. Hopefully. I don't know, man. My gut's kind of telling me to not work on this one and go for the main building, Jen. But I'm, I'm going against my gut. We're just going to work on this, Jen, and pray for the best. Hopefully we don't get through, Jen. Jane's in chase right now. She's one hit. Alright, perfect. Main building, Jen, is done. There's a totem over there, one over there, and a Jen over there. Um, 
Okay, so that totem and that gen is probably the next game plan. Hear the ray. I don't see the ray. I'm gonna keep working. He sounds like he's pretty close though. Oh, he got my boon. I gotta run. I gotta run. Not leaving any scratch marks. Now I'm leaving scratch marks. But hopefully I've managed to slip. Give him the slip. I think I have given him the slip. Very good. Oh, and boon that totem. Very nice. Oh, snappers. Oh, snappers. Where's Ray? Where's the Ray? You self carrying? Let me heal you. You know, self carrying is not not the thing you want to do, girl. Takes forever. Yes, it does. Oh. Also, I just realized I ran out of gel dressings, so I actually only have one heal in this med kit. Oh, schnappers. Oh, schnappers. That was a little scary. Like, slikes! Scoob! Let her do that. I'm gonna put the boon back up. No boon, no work. You understand? No boon, no work. You cannot guarantee safe work conditions. Of my aura not being revealed to the killer, then I will not work. He's back again. I don't see. Oh, he's over there. No fear. No boon! No work! Alright, nice. We're about to pop this. I'm gonna move a little bit this way to get more detective punch value. Um, so there's a gen there. Um, there's no boons over here, though. Oh, you quit. Well. <laughs> All right. That happened. All right, guys, we're back on the Shelter Woods. I was going to end after that game, but we cannot leave on a killer disconnect. Come on. Come on. What was that? Oh, hi. I found a boon. Yes, yes. No boon, no work. You understand? You understand no boon? No boon, no work. That's, that's what we do on this build, guys. No boon, no work. All right. All right, all right. We can work. We're going to work. I see a gen over there. We'll work on it. We're going to work on it from the shadows of the shadow step. Man who has sex with bread has taken a hit. Lovely. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Sometimes these people have the funniest names. Nom. And then Mr. Joe Juan TTV. Oh, we got a Twitch streamer up in the lobby, guys. Playing as Sebel? Sebel? I think that's that girl's name. Oh, well, it's a Scourge Hook. And it's a Huntress. Hmm, but damn, she's pretty good with her axes. We got a front row ticket to the show. Dead Man's as well. Jen's blocked. Dude, our team is getting beat up. They're getting pretty beat up bad. All right, we're going to work on this gen a little bit. When she comes back to pick that guy up, we will. Um, Maybe I can go. No, he's not 99 yet. All right, we're going to have to get off here. Three, two, one. Okay. Score choke. Uh, damn, I think it made my other gen regress even more. All right, all right, all right. We gotta work on some gens, guys. We're two hooks in already. No gens done. It's never a good place to be. I don't know why Leon's going for the rescue. He's one hit. He goes for the unhook. He's gonna get hatchet hit, and then he's gonna go down, and then he's gonna get hooked again, and then he's gonna get scorch hook again, and then we're just never gonna win. All right, all right. They got away though. No, nope, see, this is what I'm saying, dude. Like, if you're injured. You probably should not go for the hook. Uh, I'm going to keep working. I really want to get a gen done. And then I'll try and get him up. He's still got to get 99 on his health anyways. 
Oh, oh, little little scourge hook. Oh, snaps. Oh, snaps. All right. Oh, we gotta back up a little. What? What? How do you know I'm here? How do you know I'm here? How do you know I'm here? Ow, you're a bully. You know that? You're a real bully. Oh, snaps! Bro! Bro. I, how did she... Uh, I don't know, man. Something about that whole engagement felt fishy. Like, she knew exactly where I was at. I mean, I don't know. I know there's, like, cheaters and stuff in this game, but how do you know if someone's, you know, cheating? You know what I'm saying? Uh, but I don't... I'm not calling her a cheater. I'm just saying, like, dang, she, like, really... Like, she went straight to me after she hooked the other guy. I'll heal up real quick. And, um... I had walked away from the gen, so I didn't leave any scratch marks. There was really nothing to track me, and she knew I was right behind that rock, you know? Like, you know, maybe she just had intuition, but... Because the score trick blew up that gen. But still. Like, I'm in the Shadow Step Boon right now, so my aura should be blocked. So if she does actually see me and know where I'm at, then, like... Alright, alright. Okay. Okay. Um, she's lingering around this area still. She doesn't want me going back to that gen. Gen there. Gen there, gen there. I, I'm going back to my gen. Totem there. Let's just stop progressing this one real quick. You know, alright. Brack, what the hell? No, I'm going back to this gen. I almost finished this gen. Yes, yes, yes. I love that you're here. I love it. I love it. Nice. Very good. There's another gen here. Totem here. Totem there. Alright, so we got this gen. We got that gen. And that means the last gen should be on the other side of the map. So we will not be getting three gen. Which you'd love to hear. I'm going to boon this up. Relocate our shadow boon. Um, yeah, maybe she just got lucky. Because she would have seen me there behind the rock. Oh, snaps. Shadow Boon's up. Not leaving any scratch marks. Alright, 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 alright. She checked the gen, saw no work on it, walked away. That's what happened. That's what happened. No boon, no work. I has boon, I do work. Boon, work. No boon, no work. Uh... Man who has sex with bread is dead. And you know why? Because that's just unnatural, bro. Who does that? Who has sex with bread? Nobody. Nobody. Maybe if it was like a sex doll or something, like, that's still, you know, a little bit unnatural, but it'll, oh. Oh, the dead man's. Uh. I'm gonna just run off, use my shadow step, not leave any scratch marks. Um. Well, man, where is she? This this gen is still blocked, with dead man. So I'm just open this chest, see what's in here. So at least I'm I'm kind of being productive. Oh, she's coming back. Oh, she found my boon. Make your move, huntress. There you are. Damn it. I'm, I know I don't have my boon up, but I'm just gonna go back to working on this gen. I know. I know I'm not putting my boon up. If you noticed that I kind of just stopped talking, it's because I'm hyper-focused on this game. <laughs> 
I'm like watching all the corners to make sure she doesn't like throw a hatchet or something from like far away. All right, fantastic, fantastic. There's another boon way over there. And one over there. The last gen must be somewhere on that side of the map because I see everything within 64 meters. But I don't see the last gens. So, yeah, yeah, it's gotta be like over here somewhere. So we'll shadow step this boon over here and then try to find another gen. And this is actually, um, what was I even saying? Actually what? All right, it's okay, it's okay. Come on, let's get our shadow step up, please, quickly. Before the barbecue? Uh, well, she has barbecue. We're within 40 meters, so she still shouldn't see us, technically. All right, Shadow Boon's up. Very good. Very good. We feel safe. We're gonna come out from the shadows, get our girl, and then find a gen. Come on. Run to the Shadow Boon. Run. Come to my temple. Come to my shroud, shrouded temple. All right, he found Nom. It's okay, Nom hasn't been hooked at all. She's got two hooks left, so pretty sure we get this last gen done. Um, it's just a matter of finding it. All right, she, homegirl's down. Um, oh, it's right here, found it. And it's just within our, it's just out of our boon range. Let's stand here in case she's got barbecue real quick. Um, that way she doesn't see us. Also, she does have Scourge hooks. Oh, she's way over there. Perfect. Alright, so no barbecue value for her. She is coming this way, though. But I, I gotta work. Oh, shit. Oh, I gave away my position. Bad. Shadow Boon! You don't see me? I'm leaving no scratch marks. Oh snaps! Oh snaps! We're gonna we're gonna slow vault that. Oh nice! <laughs> I think we gave her the slip. I think we gave her the slip. She found my boon, but I'm gone. I'm still not leaving any scratch marks. Oops. All right, all right, all right. Now I'm leaving scratch marks. But I think we managed to give her the slip. Holy crap, dudes! That's what I'm talking about, boys. Shadow boon. People be sleeping on the Shadow Boon. Holy crap. I literally would not have gotten away from that chase if it wasn't for that Shadow Boon, dude. Like, my scratch marks being hidden, that, that literally just stalled enough time for me to actually get distance. Let's put our Boon back up and go back to that gen. Oh, dude. That was clutch. That was clutch. Oh, oh. Is she still chasing you? Uh, okay, okay, okay. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Also, we're not making any sound. All right, what are you doing? We gotta heal each other up. Come on. That's, we're, we're kind of out in the open. All right, she's chasing Mr. Joja Un. Jojun, the TTV is getting chased. I hear her. She's getting louder. Damn, she's dead. All right. Uh, is she gonna get Mori? What's happening? He's leaving her slugged. Okay, now she's gonna hook her. Oh, girl. Nom! What are you doing, Nom? She, oh, dude, she's coming right for us. That's unlucky. Shadow Boon! Shadow Boon! Oh, dude! That was crazy! He's snuffing the boon. Oh. 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 I'm gonna boom this and open the chest and try and heal up. I don't. Oh my god, dude. Oh. This. Oh god, Nom's gonna die. I think this is gonna be a hatch match, guys. Like, I know that Jen's over there, but she's just kind of close to it. And then there's another Jen. Literally. The other two Jen's gotta be on the other side of the map. Okay. Oh, lucky! Oh, boon. Run to the boon. Block our aura. Heal up. Alright. She has no way of knowing that we're here. 
Oh god, that was a lucky find on that med kit. I mean, I can get you off the hook. Ooh, all right, we're doing this. We're just gonna get her off the hook. I'm gonna run back to Shadow Boon. Yes, yes, yes. I was, I was a little worried that make putting the boon up was like not the play to make, but now I'm convinced it was the play to make. Uh, no scratch marks. Just this freaking thing, Ming, and her loud ass grunts of pain. Oh god, you're blowing our cover. Okay, we gotta go. Oh no, she found me, not me. All right, M1, catch it. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We got our shadow boon. Let's just break line of sight, break line of sight, run back to the boon, run back to the boon. Let's be really confusing. No scratch marks. She has no idea where we're at, and we got away. I think. Oh shit! Oh shit! No, we didn't get away. <laughs> ah, dudes! No! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh baby girl! Baby girl! Oh baby! Oh <laughs> dudes! Oh my god, what is this game? What is this game? Oh shit! Oh dude, come on! Oh, oh god, dude! Oh my god, dude! <laughs> oh! We're actually not dead yet! We still have another hook! Oh dude, hopefully this girl got it. Oh, she's working on a gen. She might. I saw some good time. Maybe she'll pop that gen. Holy cow, dude. That was some Shadow Step juking right there. Holy cow. Dude. Shadow Step is so slept on. I'm gonna do a video. Like, my top... I don't know how many, but like, top... Five, seven, eight underrated perks. And, uh... I'm pretty sure Shadow Step's gonna be one of those. I don't really see a lot of people using it, but it's... I don't know, I feel like it's just really valuable. Alright. Alright. Oh no. She screamed from the scorch hook. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna die. I made this big mistake before where I don't kill myself. I'm gonna die and hopefully she can get the hatch. Oh no, she took her dead heart hit. Come on, come on, get the hatch, girl. I'm dying. I'm dying. Maybe she'll get a lucky hatch spawn. Let's see. No, she just went down. All right, maybe she's getting worried. Can we spectate? Oh uh, no, that's it. GGS. All right, guys. I hope you enjoy that episode. The usual business: leave a like, comment, subscribe for the algorithm. We are, as of me recording this video, we are 200 subscribers away from 1,000 subscribers. That absolutely blows my mind. And I'm super excited and super pumped for where this channel is going and the growth that's happening in this channel. And I'm super grateful to each and every one of you because this would not be possible without you, the viewer. So thank you for watching this content. Thank you for enjoying these videos. And don't forget, until next time, have an amazing day. And do not forget to smile. I will see you on the next one. But actually, one real quick. Man who has sex with bread was doing the self-care challenge. <laughs> Rest in peace, bro. All right, I'm out. <laughs>